Jewish religious clothing has been influenced by biblical commandments, modesty requirements and the contemporary style of clothing worn in the many societies in which Jews have lived. In Judaism, clothes are also a vehicle for religious ritual. <laughs> Men's clothing Many Jewish men historically wore turbans, tunics, cloaks, and sandals. Topic: Talit, Zitzit, and Talit Katan. Topic: The Talit is a Jewish prayer shawl worn while reciting morning prayers as well as in the synagogue on Sabbath and holidays. In Yemen, the wearing of such garments was not unique to prayer time alone, but was worn the entire day. The tallit has special twined and knotted fringes known as zitzit attached to its four corners. It is sometimes referred to as arba kanfo lit. Four corners. Although the term is more common for a tallit katan, an undergarment with zitzit. According to the biblical commandments, zitzit must be attached to any four-cornered garment, and a thread with a blue dye known as tekele is supposed to be included in the zitzit. Since they are considered by Orthodox tradition to be a time bound commandment, they are worn only by men. Conservative Judaism regards women as exempt from wearing zitzit, not as prohibited. Some progressive Jewish women choose to take on the obligation of zitzit and tefillin. Jewish men are buried in a tallit as part of the takrikim, shroud, burial garments. Topic <laughs> kippa. Topic. A kippah or yarmulke, also called a kapal or skull cap, is a thin, slightly rounded skull cap traditionally worn at all times by Orthodox Jewish men, and sometimes by both men and women in conservative and reform communities. Its use is associated with demonstrating respect and reverence for God. Jews in Arab lands did not traditionally wear yarmulkes, but rather larger rounded hats without brims. Topic: Kittel. A kittel, Yiddish, kittel is a white, knee-length, cotton robe worn by Jewish prayer leaders and some Orthodox Jews on the high holidays. In some families, the head of the household wears a kittel at the Passover Seder. In some circles it is customary for the groom at a Jewish wedding to wear a kittel under the wedding canopy. <laughs> Women's clothing Married Orthodox Jewish women wear a scarf, tishel or mitpahit, snood, hat, beret, or sometimes a wig shadal, in order to conform with the requirement of Jewish religious law that married women cover their hair. There are non canonical rabbinical writings on hair covering in relation to tzniut, meaning modesty, such as Shulchan Aruch, Rabbi Jacob ben Asher. S. Stone of Help 115, 4, Orich Chaim 75, 2, even Ha. Ezer 21, 24, Jewish women were distinguished from others in the western regions of the Roman Empire by their custom of veiling in public. The custom of veiling was shared by Jews with others in the eastern regions. The custom petered out among Roman women but was retained by Jewish women as a sign of their identification as Jews. The custom has been retained among Orthodox women. Jewish women also wore shawls or other head coverings at the time of the New Testament, keeping their hair long. Evidence drawn from the Talmud shows that pious Jewish women would wear shawls over their heads when they would leave their homes, but there was no practice of fully covering the face. In the medieval era Jewish women started veiling their faces under the influence of the Islamic societies they lived in. In some Muslim regions such as in Baghdad, Jewish women veiled their faces until the 1930s. In the more lax Kurdish regions, Jewish women did not cover their faces. <laughs> Jewish verses Gentile customs equals equals A question was posed to Rabbi Joseph Kolin Maharik regarding Gentile clothing and whether or not a Jew who wears such clothing transgresses a biblical prohibition that states you shall not walk in their precepts Leviticus chapter 18 verse 3 In a protracted responsum Rabbi Kolin wrote that any Jew who might be a practicing physician is permitted to wear a physician S cape traditionally worn by Gentile physicians on account of their expertise in that particular field of science and their wanting to be recognized as such, and that the Jewish physician who wore it has not infringed upon any law in the Torah, even though Jews were not known to wear such garments in former times. 
He noted that there is nothing attributed to superstitious practice by their wearing such a garment, while, at the same time, their isn. T anything promiscuous or immodest about wearing such a cape, neither is it worn out of haughtiness. Moreover, he has understood from Maimonides Hill. Avodit Kokavim 11 1 that there is no commandment requiring a fellow Jew to seek out and look for clothing which would make them stand out as different from what is worn by Gentiles, but rather, only to make sure that what a Jew might wear is not an exclusive Gentile item of clothing. He noted that wearing a physician's cape is not an exclusive Gentile custom, noting, moreover, that since the custom to wear the cape varies from place to place, and that, in France, physicians do not have it as a custom to wear such capes, it cannot therefore be an exclusive Gentile custom. According to Rabbi Colin, modesty was still a criterion for wearing Gentile clothing, writing, Less than pre greater than slash pre greater than dot 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 even if Israel made it as their custom to wear a certain item of clothing, while the Gentiles would wear something different, if the Israelite garment should not measure up to the standard established in Judaism or of modesty more than what the Gentiles hold as their practice, there is no prohibition whatsoever for an Israelite to wear the garment that is practiced among the Gentiles, seeing that it is in keeping with the way of fitness and modesty just as that of Israel. Topic. See also. Topic. Gardel. Kaftan. Strimal. Jewish hat. Topic. References. Topic. Notes. Further reading. Rubens, Alfred, 1973 A History of Jewish Costume. ISBN 0-297-76593-0. Silverman, Eric, 2013 A Cultural History of Jewish Dress. London, Bloomsbury. ISBN 978-1-84788-286-8. External links Topic. Media related to Jewish clothing at Wikimedia Commons